Well, as the guardian, you are in a position of trust for the ward uh, who you have guardianship over. That could be a minor. Uh, I've seen a lot of cases recently where uh, people who are suffering with certain mental uh, incapacities are not competent. Uh, elderly people who have uh, dementia, Alzheimer's also need a guardian. And you will uh, be responsible for making sure that the assets of the ward are not diminished or deteriorated or lost or wa wasted. So the guardianship has certain uh, annual reports that have to be given to the court to uh, account for where the money's been spent. Sometimes you have a monthly budget that uh, the court will enforce uh, for spend expenditures on the award. And uh, this guardianship is to protect the assets of the ward. You have a guardianship of the person and a guardianship of the property, which is to protect and make sure things are done right uh, for the ward in case of a guardianship. And if they have a class that they require the guardians to take to advise them of their responsibilities under Florida law so that uh, everybody can know uh, what their rights are and their responsibilities.